welcome back to my channel. Today we have a special guest. Hey guys. We're going to do the 35 interesting husband tag question list. We'll see how that goes because he doesn't know any of the questions. I've read them ahead of time, but he all know. Okay, so we're just going to jump right in so we can get this um, to be as short as possible. Okay, how and where did we meet? Facebook. Yes and no. You said, I know him. And you friended me. <laughs> yeah, but where did I know you for? Where did we okay, meet? Well, uh, we sort of met, I guess, in Ball High School. In high school. Yeah, we met in Galveston. High what was your first impression? <laughs> Whatever. <laughs> Whatever. I know the story. Let's see if he does. Um. Well, I liked her in high school, but she was pretty attached to somebody else at the time. So... <laughs> <laughs> there was no going there right then. I, I thought he was hot in high school, so. But, yeah. And now look at... No, I'm <laughs> <laughs> How and where was our first date? Oof. Our first date was probably when... At Chili's with the... Uh, I mean... Yeah. That's when we first met. It's when I flew yeah. in from San Diego. Where was our first kiss and how was it? <laughs> First kiss was me walking into the lobby area of uh, Hobby Airport and her just grabbing me and start kissing me. Yep. That Not, was... Hello, how you doing? I'm Wendy. Nice to meet you in person. <laughs> it was just, come here. Get over here. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah. It was at least a month we were talking online doing the long distance thing. I was in Sugar Land and he was in San Diego. And when he flew in, I just, that was just my first response. So... Have that uh, reaction to people. <laughs> oh, you have that effect on people? Yes, I do. <laughs> when did you meet my family? The next day. <laughs> you met Well, two. I met Robert and Dee the next day. My brother we and my sister We went out to eat, had lunch. Yeah. And then um, I think it was Mother's Day weekend, I flew back in again, and you met my parents, and I think I met your dad and your mom at that time. Yeah, I think that's when... And Bill. So we started talking in February... We met in March, again, because we'd known each other from high school. And then May was when we actually met the family. I don't know when you met my dad, though. It must have been the next time I came down. I don't remember. Um, how did you know I was the one? Mm. <laughs> I don't know. Everything just kind of clicked. It just made sense to me. Yeah, I don't know if that... How does, I mean, how does anybody really know? They just know. Yeah. It, it's a deep gut feeling. I knew I just wanted to spend the rest of my life with you and nobody else. Oh. I, mean, I love you and... I love you too, baby. I knew that, you know. When and why did you fall in love with me? <laughs> that kind of ties up with the one just before. Some of these questions are like, what? So when uh, and why did you fall in love with me? <laughs> I don't know. I, like I said, I just did. I, I don't know when. It just it happened over the time. I think because we spent so much time talking to each other instead of being around each other because of a long distance relationship, I got to know your intellect and, um, you know, got to know you a lot more than just your appearance, you know. And uh, because I had to... I pretty much had to make do with just talking to her <laughs> and getting to know her more than being around her at the time. And so I did. And, you know, I just, I fell in love with your mind and the way you talk and the way you speak more or quicker because that's what I had at the time. And, yeah. you know. How long have we been together, relationship and marriage? Nine, ten years. Well, we've been together nine years. We'll be married eight years this October. Yeah. So this past February... I was just adding it all together. Well, we're not quite to 10 yet. <laughs> so February 2018, we were dating nine years. And then October, this October, we'll be married eight years. October the 10th. Yes. I know. <laughs> how did you, how do you resolve problems? Stamp my feet and yell at it. Usually goes away. <laughs> Uh, Would you like to try again? That was the incorrect <laughs> answer. <No. laughs> mm, how do you resolve problems? I think this I is usually just say yes, dear. 
<laughs> isn't that, isn't that the, the fix? We are both hard-headed and German, and I'm also Indian and Irish, and we bumped heads. We bump heads. We, we are very... When, you know... Explosive. Yeah. But we have learned over the years how to... Basically, what's really what what makes... We know what buttons to push and not to push. Not to push, yeah. We know our triggers, and we've learned not to push them. And we both learned... We've both grown together and learned not to keep going when something is... You know, the other person's clearly upset. We don't keep going. We just, we take a breath. We take a breather. No win to say win. <laughs> yeah. And we've, we learn that the hard way, too. It, it doesn't come, you know, oh, magically one day. It just, we learn the hard way, and we're better for it, I think. So, what do you two do for a living, and are you using your college degree? <laughs> college? <laughs> um, no. No. I don't think neither one of us are. Um... And I don't know how many people out there actually do. Yeah. I mean, I'm sure there are people out there who go to school for something and they get out of school. And they do it. And they find that job that they've been looking for and it's what they wanted to do. But I think there's a lot of people out there that go to school for one thing and they get out and they find a job in a totally other field or mm -hmm. something that has nothing to do with what they went to school for. And both of us have computer degrees. And, I mean, we do buying and selling online. That's I don't even want to do computers anymore. <laughs> and I also have my real estate license. I don't do that, but I do also trying to get my YouTube channel going up. Um, yeah, thanks, YouTube. <sighs> yeah, that's a whole sore spot there. What key elements make a successful relationship and marriage? <laughs> Patience. It is a virtue. Patience, I think, is part of a key because you got to have patience to learn the other person. Patience to know when they're to a point where they can't discuss something or... You know, I think patience is a huge, 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 huge part of marriage. And I don't have patience. <laughs> <laughs> I, I think a lot of it, too, comes down to communication. And if you can't communicate everything that you need to communicate with someone that you spend your, you know, intimate moments with and your every waking moment, not every waking moment, but every day of your life with, then stop. <laughs> I was trying to be serious. Me too. <laughs> <laughs> but seriously, communication and, like you said, patience. Those are just some key things. And just learning. You have to learn the other person, which does take patience. And, you know, just not giving up at the first sign of trouble. trouble or first sign of, you know, things aren't going your way. Because we you got to remember, you're two separate people trying to live your life together. You have different thoughts. You have different... Uh, uh, pet peeves you have different uh, thought process of how something should go so you have to learn to meld those two things together and uh, find what works yeah I mean you really do what do you love about me <laughs> uh. your spirit I love your spirit I love the oh, I your attitude towards things sometimes and how do you keep a, a relationship healthy in life? This is kind of similar to... If your wife's what? vegan, you go vegan. If your wife is uh, not eating dairy, you don't eat yes deer a lot. That works. Uh, <laughs> she says something, she's right. Compromise. That's how you keep it healthy. You have yes. to compromise. Compromise. That's what I was going for. That's what I said. <laughs> I, I know. I, I know. I was just backing you up, baby. <laughs> just backing you up. Places you want to travel. <laughs> You know, with everything going on in the world, I don't want to leave the United States. I don't want to go to some other country right now, um, especially with all the crap that's going on in the world and all the different, you know, countries not getting along right now. I, I, I don't, okay. I don't want to go anywhere. Putting that aside, I will say I want to go to Ireland, and I. What? I answered the question. I don't care, um, <laughs> and I want to go to Germany. This guy's already been to Germany. He doesn't know. There. He didn't know it though. <laughs> uh, he's actually born in Germany, but I would like to check out Germany. I would like to check out uh, Ireland. I want to go to Spain, and I want to go to Thailand. There's a lot, a lot of places in or areas in Thailand that are not horrible, and um, there's a big vegan community in Thailand. I'd like to see an eight by eight square footage of um, 
Tahiti Beach. That'd be fine with me. What? Because that's where I'm going to stay in my little eight foot by eight foot area on a beach in Tahiti. <laughs> Children? Question mark. How many do you want? No more. <laughs> Got two. I'm I good. wanted I zero. Two. I got two beautiful baby girls, and um, even though they're older now, they're still my babies, and um, I don't want any more. <laughs> and I didn't want any when I met him. Uh, I didn't I didn't want to have babies. I still don't want to have babies. I got two that were three and five when we met, and they're my babies. Uh, I didn't give birth. That's my whole problem with it. Yeah. It's, it's, not, it's not in my cards. Sorry. Not for me. But I took those girls, and I raised them as... They were as if they were mine. They call me mommy. I love them just like they're my own. I wouldn't trade it for the world. I'm glad that he came with two girls. So <laughs> the kids that we have together, they're they're furry. <laughs> and there's six of them. What is my favorite color? Dum dum dum. This is not a difficult answer. Uh black. Although black is the absence of color. Actually, no. White is the absence of color. Black that's is all right. the colors. That's right. That's right. That's right. That's right. I was backwards. I'm dyslexic. Yeah. <laughs> uh, See, I, I had actually, it right up here. I'm actually wearing both of my favorite colors right now. Pink and black. Yep. Pink and black. I Never do <laughs> like... <laughs> do you like purple? I was um, going to say purple first, and I knew, oh, black. Uh, what is my favorite food? All. <laughs> as long as it's plant-based, yeah. Um, I don't... I'm going to go with, you love hummus. I do. But you also love yellow rice. I do. Uh, potatoes. 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 <laughs> Boil them, mash them, stick them in a stew. Um, so, yeah, there you go. I'm going to go with uh, grilled burritos that my wife makes. <laughs> uh, what is my favorite sports team? No, there isn't one. <laughs> um, wait a minute, there is one. What What's is the name of Harry Potter's team? <laughs> Quidditch? Isn't that the game? <laughs> Quidditch, yeah. Uh, well, that would be the Gryffindor. The Gryffindors. The Gryffindor Quidditch team. That's anyway. it. That's her favorite team. <laughs> uh, what is Can't my find team? it on ESPN at all. No. Uh, what is my favorite TV show? Right now, I'm going to say Young Sheldon of the Middle, because we've been binge-watching those. But what is my all-time favorite show? The one that I will keep going back to, and I don't mean movies. Uh, oh, no, that's um, uh, Golden Girls. No. I mean, that's one of them, but no. Mur Murder, She Wrote? That's one of them, but no. I quote it a lot. You quote a lot of things a lot. This is true. <laughs> um, wow. I guess they're scrubs. No. He doesn't even know me. <laughs> what? There's ten seasons. Have I seen them? Yes. Uh, probably seasons? not all ten seasons. I don't know. But they're still on TV. They're very popular. I'll be there for you. Yeah, that helps. Friends! Oh, oh. Friends is not on anymore. Yeah, it's still on, like, they still repeat it on. Oh, uh, reruns. Okay. Yeah, reruns. No, it's not yeah, on anymore. Yeah, Friends. But... And I've watched everything on that. Me and you have watched that. Really? Yeah. I don't remember that. I actually made you sit down and watch ten seasons of Friends. Yeah, Friends is funny. Yeah. It's not my favorite, but it's funny. What food do I not like? Meat. <laughs> no, it's not that I don't like meat. I just don't prefer... Like <laughs> I don't prefer to kill animals for my taste buds. That's what. I didn't stop eating meat because I didn't like it. You know my loathed things. You know what I do not eat. Watermelon. No. Watermelon no, is melon. only That's melon. melon. You don't like... <laughs> Uh, cantaloupe. Uh. <laughs> Peas. Finally. Peas. Peas. Now, I gotta go through the index of my brain, you know? <laughs> now, I will not eat cantaloupe at all. Like, if it's even in a fruit salad touching another one, I, will, I won't do it. But, peas, if they're in something, as I've gotten older, I'll still eat them. It just depends on how the pea... Like, Indian food, I'll eat peas in Indian food. Like, the rice and things like that. I'll uh, Inside some uh, potato samosas, I will eat peas. But, like, in... Like a soup or something, or a dish that just has... No, I can't do peas like that, no. Like, people just sit down and eat a bowl of peas. No. Nuh-uh. What is my favorite type of sandwich? 
<sighs> Satan sandwich. <laughs> yes, I like Satan on my sandwich. No, Satan. <laughs> um. Before you stop eating meat, I would say a Reuben. Although I do have a Satan recipe for a good Satan Reuben or corned beef. But anyway, no, actually, I'm not a big sandwich person. Whenever we go to Subway, I would get like the, um, I would always get pretty much the same thing when I'd go to Subway. And it was the, oh, I can't even remember what I used to get before. Um, I think it was the, was it the steak? No, it was the Italian BMT. Yeah. That's what I used to get from Subway all the time was the Italian BMT. Now at Subway, I just get like the veggies with everything on it. I don't get the veggie patty because I think it's vegetarian instead of vegan, but I'm not a big sandwich person. I'm just not. But I will... Dogs. If I could eat one thing every day, what would it be? Yellow rice. Just rice in general. <laughs> rice or potatoes. Rice and potatoes <laughs> yeah. and beans. In fact, I think I do already. What is my eye color? <laughs> you know my eye color. Green or hazel. No, that's your worst. Well, you should match me. We're married. <laughs> yes, because that's how it works. Next question. <laughs> wow. <laughs> my eyes are blue. blue. Who is my best friend? I am. Of course. What is something that I do that you wish I wouldn't? <laughs> oh, this is a loaded question. Something you do that I wished you wouldn't. Leave the cabinet door open. <laughs> I don't know what's wrong. You open it, you get something out, you shut it. It's a three-part process. <laughs> um, that and you complain. Just complain. Compl no, I'm just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> He's not kidding, though. I do complain a lot. I mean, happy wife, happy life, and you're just not quite there yet. Mm, sure. <laughs> what is my heritage, and where am I from? Well, you're German, Irish, and Indian, and you were like born in Germany. Earlier. I was not. I mean, I mean you're born in Galveston. <laughs> G G. You know, I'm G G. G. <laughs> born in uh, Galveston. Almost said it again. Yeah, I'm a Texan. Um, <laughs> Y'all. Did I play any sports? No. Uh, if you baked me a cake, what kind would I like? Vegetarian one at least, at a minimum. <laughs> no dairy, no egg. So, just a cracker. <laughs> right? I mean, flatbread, and then oh. nothing that rises. <laughs> No, you can have yeast, right? <laughs> this is why we don't do this. Uh, no. Uh, I My favorite cake was cheesecake. Because I didn't like fluffy cake. Because it would always like... Uh, I just Milk. It, I didn't, it didn't agree with me. It's so, so fluffy! <clears throat> it didn't agree with me. So I would eat cheesecake. So if you were to make me a cake... Now, I would um, want a cheesecake veganized. And you can do them. I've seen plenty. It's just not worth it. <laughs> I mean, it just takes everything out of cheesecake. You don't put cheese in a cheesecake. Oh, my God. <laughs> this is why I do all the cooking. Uh, what is one unique talent that I have? Your makeup. Your makeup body is just fantastic. Thank you. Is that unique? I think so. Not everybody can put makeup on. <laughs> <laughs> Weird habits of each other. Ooh. Of each other? So that means I get to talk about you now. <laughs> you like to lay in bed and just randomly make weird noises. <laughs> like constantly. Like, <laughs> I don't just lay in bed and do it. I do it all over the house. Oh, I'm crying. Oh, it's true. I wouldn't call it a weird habit more than a, an annoying habit, probably. No, it's, it's weird. It's weird and annoying. When he yawns. I can hear it all the way in my office. Like, he, he's like, oh, like he sounds like a dying cow or something when he yawns. And then he has this thing where I guess he broke his ankle. <laughs> he broke his ankle and it like clicks. He does this clicky thing with his ankle and it, it it's so weird. It drives me crazy. Oh, 
Another weird habit, and I don't know if it would be a weird habit, but he shakes. Like, he'll he'll sit there and he'll just be, like, shaking his foot and or wiggling, like, his foot or something, or and it'll shake the table, or it'll shake the bed. <laughs> like, constantly throughout dinner at a restaurant or something, you should... Take it, take it, take it, grab it, sit. Motion sit. It doesn't it. make me sit. Sure. Look <laughs> <laughs> what you just did. <sighs> anyway... Uh, what do we argue about the most? <laughs> Our pet peeves. <laughs> <laughs> Lately? Uh, nothing. Uh, um, now that I live in the country, I don't have any issues. Yeah, we really don't argue as much, nearly as much as we did. when Stress level is way down. Yeah. Um, if we argue about something, it's because I've asked him to do something and he didn't do it. Just because I haven't done it in three months doesn't mean I'm not going to do it. What is my favorite restaurant? Yamoto's? No. And that would be Yamato. Uh, The Mossies. It used to be the Mossies whenever I would eat meat. And now it's a tie between two places you've never been to. Yeah. That's my favorite restaurant, (laughs) her kitchen. (laughs) Well, like, my two favorite restaurants now, it's a tie between Pepper Tree in Houston and Thai Cottage in Webster. So, I haven't found a place down here that I'm just, like, in love with yet. And I'd like to find that, but... So, they will soon be replaced. (laughs) Um, What can I spend hours doing? Makeup. Cooking. Complaining. Oh, wait. (laughs) (laughs) We're almost done! Oh, my gosh! Who is the one to say, I love you first, and where was it? I think it was me, and you were in your car, weren't you? And I was talking to you on the phone? Yep. Yep. Yes, yes, indeedy. Uh, I was driving home from work. I lived in Sugar Land at the time, and I remember we were, I was driving home, and... It's when I was a Pokemon master, and I said, I want you! <laughs> Actually, you know what? That was our first conversation when I was driving home. Yeah, I, yeah but I agree. It but it was, we were still on the phone, the obviously, and I think I was driving, and I was in the car when he said it, or... Yeah, but it was accident. on the phone. <laughs> no, it wasn't that one. <laughs> right. But I remember him telling me, and I was like... Thank you. <laughs> Thanks. Thanks. Well, you're welcome. <laughs> I don't think I was ready at the time to say that. I was like, I I don't even know what I said. I, I don't know. I don't remember. I was like, I need so to run away now. Months ago. I need to run away now. <laughs> okay, um, thanks, bye. <laughs> right. Okay, thank you. What is your most repeated phrase or sentence? Goodbye. <laughs> uh, what is your? Well, it says what is your. Oh, mine. It just says what is your most repeated. So you're just who farted. <laughs> um, what is mine? What is your most? Uh... Okay, thank you. He's doing the shaking thing right now. He's doing. I'm the thinking. <laughs> Doing the shaking thing right now. I don't... We're going to think of this one that's over. Um, yes, dear? <laughs> it's not the most overused. Probably, like, if I'm not back in five minutes, just wait longer. Yeah, I you, say, you that, say a that a lot. Not back in five minutes, just wait longer. Yay, we got through the husband tag. Love you. Love you, too. Okay, bye. (laughs) (laughs) All right, guys. Thanks for watching. And please don't forget to like and subscribe. The buttons are all down there. And then you can follow me on all kinds of (laughs) of social media. It's all down below. If you like this guy, he has his own channel, which has like one video on it. But, um, yeah, go give him some love, too, if you want. You know, he's going to probably eventually start making them whenever I make him. Yeah, I'm going to redo it. I did like a GTA 5 thing just for fun, just to do it. It's ridiculous. And uh, (laughs) I don't know. I'm going to come up with some better stuff. Uh, Probably just me doing stuff around here and stuff like that. And. Because I've been building a pretty cool fence that's out there, and that's yeah. been fun. Um, you need to record that. Yeah. I recorded that, a little bit of it. But. So, anyways, it would be better content, and actual real content, not just a game or something like that. I don't even play it anymore, hardly. <laughs> yeah. So, anyway, guys, I hope you're doing well, and I'll talk to you next one. Bye! Bye. 
and I love about him, he can... This is his husband. I know, but I really want to answer this because I... I okay, fine. <laughs> it is true, it's about me. Uh, you keep losing the spot. I don't know! I keep bumping it, I think. They're going down. I know, I'm gonna go back to the... Can't take me nowhere. Where's that place that has those like little places over the water that you can stay at? It's like really gorgeous. It's some island off. Why do you I think know. I know this? I, Cause I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. I, I mean, I've seen the picture too in the magazines, but I don't know <laughs> resort uh, waterfront. It's a whole growing something and stuff. Like I, a wet nope. Saint Bernard trying to fit through a cat door. <sighs> it's horrible. <laughs> Lord, we're 20 minutes in and I'm only on question number 21. Well, stop talking and keep asking. Ah! It's about me, now you. <laughs> it's actually about me. What is my favorite type of sandwich? Um, and then if we argue about if any. Blah, blah, blah. And then. <laughs> and then. <laughs> um, your. <use> <laughs> I'm a jerk. <laughs>